sock, which is a walleye technique that Lance taught us when we were walleye fishing with him for trout. Anyway, welcome. Can you see me? Make sure that you see me. All right, now I'll do that. Welcome to Hoppers on Lakes. That guy nice ate a Moorish. What's that? Nice perch. Nice perch. Like strip strip. Oh, I'm crossing these old freedom. Come on, Brandon, what do you expect me to do here? I got my oh, line. Oh, this is supposed to be a multitasking cameraman. Casting it with one hand. Trying to film Brandon with the other hand. Catch the hopper fish right after I put the camera away on Cheech's. Don't get any rest here. Well, that looks like a tiger trout. Is a tiger trout? Hey. Them aren't natives, so you got to scale them. Throw them Do you see how easy that hook comes out? Because I don't, because I fish barbless. I'm like a savage cheech. Dude, this is barbless too. I just hook them deep. So just a normal day uh, fishing grasshoppers on a lake, catching fish. And then cheech is towing us around the lake, going, finding a fish that supposedly has a fish on. I think it's just a snack. Stumposaurus. Snag that jumped up, ate a hopper, and swam right into the weeds. We have a salad chopper. Okay, thank it. You go. You go. Man, all that excitement for nothing. Lesson learned. Oh! I'm not really that mad. I'm gonna snag up again, I think, because this dude's going straight for the weeds. Oh, he's out. You're good. I see him. Nice fish. I see him. Good tiger. Good tiger. Oh, what did he oh, eat? He just threw it. Oh. It was a project hopper. Oh, the new one. The new project hopper. Okay. We can't go into details, but there's gonna be some really cool stuff with the project hopper. Here it is. Curtis, what happened? I just lost another fish. As soon as we turn this camera on, the fish throw hooks. Magic. So we should keep it on all the time so that when we hook them, they'll stay on. Okay, Big B, that's your job. Hold the camera. Excuse me. All right, Senorito. What's what's happening here? Do you wait, get, do I have a fish on? You're getting eight. Oh, wait. Sorry. I've got a fish on. I'm freaking trying to... Brandon, you're going to have to man the helm. Since I can't catch no fishes, I got to film other people catch them. Yeah, I go to I go to yeah. film Cheech. And I put my rod down. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. Probably Cheech still has his. Probably because you forgot to set the hook. That's I watched this though. guy eat. A little better angle. He's heavy. So we took a hopper, right? Yeah, I took a hopper. I just tied it so it looked like a humongous, <laughs> and I was swimming it like a leech. But, That's my uh, favorite tickler. Yeah, so basically, hopper bite kind of dropped off. We switched over to some Mitch Tip and hover lines. It's looking like a dandy. That's, oh yeah, sweet perch. Tiger! <laughs> Is that what they call fire tiger? Yeah, that was a fire. Tiger fish? So what's the story on this one? Same story. They like to chase that uh, humongous thing here. This time it is a cut rope. Throat's cut. Too many bags of Cheetos in here. Fishing with Cheech. There's no Cheetos, bro. They're peanuts. <laughs> a nice 
bass fishing. Whoa, he was hot. He was hot after I caught him. What was that fly anyway? Brank shaver in olive. Subsurface. Yeah. G chair pulling black voodoo magic on the fish. So I went to recast and this fish came up, swam, almost came out of the water when I recast. I cast again and just pulled it really fast through and he chased it and missed it. So I threw it out again, chased it down and ate it a third time. That's the beauty of tiger trout. They're dumb. They can be aggressive. Aggro. Boom. That's Big B right there. Curtis has a fish. I jigged him right up. Oh, look at him. He's a pretty Colorado. Colorangus? He took the humongous. And that's what he looks like. A little Colorado cutty. This is how I row now. No oars. Curtis gets to hang out in front of the boat. Big B's just sitting up there eating bubble gum or something. But these are my new oars. Minn Kota Traxxas 80 pound thrust, 24 volt system, and it is the bomb. Look at that wake! Off to catch more tigers. We got Big B on the radio here. Yes, sir. So what happens when you fish with these guys, they just give up on the dry fries. Don't give up on dry fries. Because they eat bionics. They eat bionics. Bionic ants. All the way down. Let's see that bad boy. You can see that little bionic. Holy crap, he really ate it. Too. He wrecked it, did it. Adios, Cuddy. I got a fish. Big B signing out. I mean, Peace. shining out for Big B. Yep. Lessons learned. Started catching fish earlier in the day with a certain fly. Took it off and I put it back on first cast. Boom. Noob. It is not a hopper. Nice pink belly cut through. Let's perch. Midge tip. Midge tip. Yep. See you later, little buddy. So we're finishing up for the day. It's gotten a little windy, but we got Brandon hooked up for uh, some fun exercises before we leave, you know, just for fun of it. Fishing fitness. View the Yeti five gallon bucket. You know what's good about this bucket? It makes you catch more fish. You know what's good about this bucket? It's a name brand, and that's really important. I could also buy a cheap bucket. I could also buy a multiple meal cereal, but I buy a name brand because I'm not poor. This also makes your boat produce 27 times more fish. We caught about 47 more times more fish than what most people catch, and we usually catch about 20 times more fish than what people catch. So if you do math, that's 47. Yep, yeah, so get yourself a Yeti bucket. Um, and shout out to Yeti, send us more free stuff. Thanks, peace. And we're on our way out. Wait, why did we stop? I ate a Maverick breakfast burrito this morning, and it's not agreeing with me. You know, be funny. <laughs> Wouldn't be a problem if you had a Yeti bucket. <laughs> Wait, you forgot the Yeti bucket. Well, how'd she roll? That's what you call a false alarm. <laughs> I don't need to explain anymore. Oh my God. Oh.
Oh, <laughs> oh dude. Oh, Don't eat. Oh, if we had smell vision right now, holy. You get back in there. Finish what you started. Oh, my gosh. I'm trapped. Woo oh, I'm just too lazy to get out. Brandon's out. <laughs> oh. You seriously need to finish what you started over Dude, there. I tried. It was a false alarm. It's like when the new guy at work forgot forgets to turn off the alarm and you get called. And you go in there and, and it's not a robber. You just go in and it's just the new guy. It's like, oh, sorry, I forgot. No big deal. Just working on some spreadsheets. I don't know what ha that has to do with car clearing farts, but oh my God. False alarms. You know your farts are bad when you have to hand sanitizer after you fart. That's true. And he smelled up the car with hand sanitizer. So it smells like a mixture of fresh strawberry carve smelly tree thinger, hand sanitizer. Shoved up a skunk's butt. <laughs> Not even, it smells like a mixture of like rotten tacos, uh, gunpowder and <laughs> like pneumonia. <laughs> I'm gonna get hit to pneumonia. pneumonia. <laughs> but it will give you pneumonia. Ammonia that leads to pneumonia. It's making me delirious the fun so bad. Oh man, this ain't right. This though. It's all brought to you by the Yeti bucket. Because if you don't have a Yeti bucket, you don't dare to fart in your car. So that's really a wrap now. Seriously, it's a wrap. So how would we end the day summarized in three words? Breakfast burritos, drugs, and humongous blink savers. Hopper munchers, cheech deadly farts, Yeti buckets. If you haven't fished in a boat with a Yeti bucket, you haven't fished. That is more than three words. <laughs> That's a lot of, you know. Bears, beats, Battlestar Galactica. Hey, by the way, Curtis, we were fishing. And he's like, hey, that's a bear up on the hill. It was a bear. Big B and I looked up. It was clearly just a black cow. <laughs> so beware of the black cows. It's just a bear with an extraordinarily long tail. And milk. And, and, and milk. And milk. Bears have milks. What? Bears have milk. Oh, they are mammals. Oh. Rib yeah, they're mammals. Okay. Bears have ribeyes. And ribeyes. Yep. Later.